Sicilian Defense, Open, Nadorf, Opposin Sky, Modern Line. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. The Sicilian defense controls the d4 square with c-pawn. Nf3 develops the knight toward the center to prepare for a d4 pawn push, where the knight will recapture if black captures on d4. d6 opens up the light squared bishop and prevents white from pushing the pawn to e5 after black eventually plays nf6. d4 offers to trade the d-pawn for the c-pawn, giving up a center pawn for more active pieces. Cx d4 gives black two central pawns versus one central pawn for white. Nx d4 recaptures the pawn and activates the knight in return for having one central pawn versus black's two central pawns. Nf6 develops the knight toward the center and attacks the undefended e4 pawn. Nc3 defends the e4 pawn and starts to develop on the queen side. A6 prepares the queen side pawn advance b7 b5, and also prevents white from playing the bishop or knight to b5. B2 develops the light squared bishop and prepares to castle king side. E5 attacks the d4 knight and prepares to develop the dark squared bishop to e7. Nb3 retreats the knight to the queen side where it controls the a5, c5, and d4 squares. B7 develops the bishop and prepares to castle. Castling gets the king out of the center and activates the rook. B6 develops the bishop toward the center and controls the d5 square. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is excellent. The rooks can see each other now allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is the last book move. A very strong play. It is excellent. This protects an under-defended pawn that is under attack. It is best. One of the best moves. It is excellent. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. That's fine. It is good. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. A solid choice. It is excellent. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. Very precise. It is best. This is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is good. Right on target. It is best. This is a fair move. It is good. This ignores an opportunity to centralize a knight so it controls more squares. This permits the opponent to kick a bishop. It is a mistake. This overlooks an opportunity to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This is the strongest option. It is best. That's an unfortunate error. It is a mistake. This moves the bishop to a more active square, making it gain scope. It is good. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. Very precise. It is best. The game was close to equal, but now black has the advantage. It is an inaccuracy. This threatens to reveal an attack on a knight. It is an inaccuracy. This prevents the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a knight. It is best. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. This threatens to win a pawn. It is excellent. This kicks an opposing knight. It is excellent. After all captures, this is an equal trade. This is the only good move. This stops the opponent from being able to win a knight. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is best. 
This misses a better way to reveal an attack on a knight. It is an inaccuracy. This ignores an opportunity to develop a rook off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This removes a knight that was threatening to win material. It is best. This moves the bishop to safety. It is good. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This overlooks an opportunity to develop a rook off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. This doubles the rooks onto a single file, which allows them to team up to create threats. It is best. This misses an opportunity to develop a rook off its starting square. It is an inaccuracy. This defends the attacked knight. This threatens to win a pawn. It is excellent. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Takes back. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is best. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is best. This is an equal trade. This is the only good move. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. A very strong play. It is excellent. This moves the bishop to a better location, allowing it to control more squares. It is good. One of the best moves. It is excellent. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. This activates a rook by developing it off of its starting square. This stops the opponent from being able to win a bishop. It is best. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players.